a really important warning about the overuse of vitamin D supplements. So vitamin D, because it causes the reabsorption of calcium, if you take too much vitamin D, you can get hypercalcemia. Now this means really high calcium levels in the blood, which is bad. So this is bad because it can cause a paradoxical weakening of bones. It can also cause damage to your heart and kidneys. Now, unless you've been given explicit instructions from a doctor or a medical practitioner who knows your case, then the generic advice that is given out by the NHS and the Department of Health and Social Care is that babies under the age of one years old should not be receiving more than a thousand international units of vitamin D per day, which is 25 micrograms. Infants between the ages of one and 10 shouldn't receive more than 2000 units per day, which is the equivalent of 50 micrograms. And then everyone else, so that means children from the ages of 11 onwards and all adults, including pregnant and breastfeeding women and the elderly should not be having more than 4,000 international units per day on a prolonged period. And that is the equivalent of 100 micrograms per day.